Does the team just feel more complete, or what effect did it have being much more complete than a couple of days ago when you left some of the guys out? Um, I mean, it's way better. Um, you know, you have to do, you don't have to do as much. Uh, you know, obviously we have a really good team, we're really deep, so it just helps us out. Uh, we're, we're much fresh. We can, you know, rotate. We can communicate. We can be better offensively. Be better defensively. And, uh, it just makes our team better. Okay, what did you think of the way the rest kind of took over in the third quarter? You better have you had a couple games off or a couple days off. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, nah, that's what he does, man. He can change the game at any moment, uh, and that's why he's so special. Um, you know, defensively, I think we've been pretty good. You know, that first quarter we gave up 30 points. Second, we limited it to 20, and then we just continue to get better. And that's going to be the key for us. Was it something that Paul was going defensively that enabled him to get to the run as easy as he did tonight? No, we were getting stops. We were getting stops and then, you know, transition. He's, uh, you know, he's, you know, we all know how fast he is. He was just getting to the to the, to the the basket. He was putting pressure on that rim. Uh, then he created opportunities for uh, the rest of us, and that's how, you know, he gets a true number. What do you think has been the biggest key to success during this Defense. Season? What about Clint Rose and all of that coming back today? Unbelievable. Same with him. <laughs> he, he was down to six, seven players last game, last few games. So he had a lot of energy as well. You know, he came in and just ran the floor very, very well. Uh, played, you know, protected the rim, uh, rebounded the basketball at a high level. Uh, things that, you know, he's capable of doing. What do you need to learn to this point in your career to keep yourself fresh when you have to play five minutes and come back to games? Because you're the very first time. Yeah, when we're playing like this and we have opportunities to you know, put, put teams away early, uh, you know, you have to do that. And so for me, and just being able to take care of my body, make sure I uh, eat well and, and get some rest and, uh, you know, cold tub, stretch, lift weights, all that good stuff to be able to prepare for the next day. So uh, it's a routine and, and obviously you have to do your own core work as well. It's just a process uh, every single day. You've obviously had some ridiculous offensive tears in your career. What is the glue you're in now? You know, how does that compare? Oh, no, 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 I don't care about that. I just, I just want to win games. And, uh, you know, tonight, just, you know, shooting my shots. Last game, shot, shot 41 shots, but we had six guys on the injury reserve list. So it's whatever it takes to win at this point. And that's what I go out there and do every single night. Is that a conscious decision you have to make going to a game that you're going to be I mean, we are, we are, it's, just, it's a team effort. You know, I'm not here to, you know, I just take what the defense gives me. And like I said, we had six guys out, seven guys out last game. Like, <laughs> which one we did not, not be aggressive. That's my mentality every single game. It don't ever change. It's crazy, but averaging 40 is... I don't really care about averaging 40. It's not why I play this game. I'm trying to win. Thank, Thank you. you.